What's going on, y'all? Let's see here. Welcome to the first ever Cantina Jam live. Thank y'all for tuning in here. Let's get this show on the road. Get my stampede string on here in case the wind starts blowing. <laughs> See, I've never done this before. We're gonna check. Uh, let's see what y'all want to hear. I'm gonna start this off. Hmm. Let's see. I'm gonna try to play y'all some songs that I uh, haven't played in a long time. Maybe haven't played them live. I'll just try them here. Y'all just let me know. Keep them coming. I'll, uh, I'll try to work through them the best I can. play too many sad songs today. Try to make this thing fun. I know I got too many of them. Let's see. What else can we do that I haven't done in a long time? Diamond is too rough. Somebody asked for that one. I'll try that one. I guess it ain't too much of a tear jerker. Oh, 
tell me they look upon my skin and bones. You're ragged and you're dirty and hardly worth your weight in gold. For all of your suffering, no one gives a good goddamn. It's all about the money, son. We doubt you understand. You're the only hope. They say my diamond is too rough. You're the only hope. I'd never trade for their love. Sometimes at night, I look upon the stars above. Shine as bright as my diamond in the rough. People they tell me just to give up and go on home. But to have no home to go to, something they'll never know. You'll let hold. Say my diamond is too rough Yo, let hope I'd never trade for their love Sometimes I feel Like I ain't getting nowhere If I'm walking down that road My lungs are out of there I never let this world get too heavy on my shoulders. My diamond always will hold the weight that I'm under. Your little they say my diamond is too rough. Waiting for some harmonica. Not more cowbell, but harmonica. Okay. Good thing I left my cowbell outside. Let's see. Tell us about that cantina. Well, I built this bar. Got a bunch of wood that I just found down in the pasture, down in the backyard. I uh, found these old redwood 2x12s down there and I drove them up. And, uh, Cut them out, stuck them on here, built this together. And just got a few little things around here that uh, kind of keep me inspired, I guess. Um, it's kind of a place to come in here and sit and write some songs or just hang out with friends and shoot shit and, you know, just get them, getting by, getting by. Uh, let's see. Thank you guys. I mean. All right, let me get in here and another song. Let me get another guitar. This is a, I'm going to tell you about this one. Um, I think this guitar is on the, the cover of the Roadhouse Sun uh, record. Um, and the headstocks broke off and sit in my hot side man. I found this thing in a, in like an antique store or a pawn shop um, somewhere out in West Texas, driving out through there. And... I didn't have it but a couple of days I took it to my buddy Reese Fulbright's house and first thing Reese did was walk out his back door and knock it off his porch and broke the headstock right off of it before I really even got a chance to play it. And uh, I had this guitar for years 
and I moved out here to Topanga, California, and this fellow named Bill Flowers uh, glued it all back together, and I just kind of started playing it over the last few years, and uh, you know, it just kind of has some mojo to it. I don't know what it is, what kind it is. There's not any real numbers on it. It's all been rubbed off. Yeah, I don't know. If any of you guys have a clue, let me know. Let me see. Let me get this thing out. This guy is a 1934 World's Fair Gibson guitar. It belongs to a friend of mine named Jim Jard. Um, I only own a couple of guitars personally, uh, but my buddy Jim owns a lot of guitars. He collects them, and uh, he's a real nice fella, and has helped me out, out a lot over the years, and uh, is really uh, kind enough to let me uh, play some of his guitars and uh, keep a few here at the house to pick on. So. I'll play a song here. One that uh, Hurricane off of the Wishbone Saloon. Boy, I ain't played this in a long time. Uh, let see if I can remember it all. I wrote this song uh, hanging out down in uh, Port Aransas, Texas. back to Yellowstone, Jeff Moore. Okay, well, I hope they do. They give me a sharper knife. That, that old Rip, he's a big, tough son of a gun. <laughs> see, uh, man, some of these songs I'd like to play, if I just can't remember. I'll have to work on them for next week. Well, I'll keep going here. South Side of Heaven, we can do that. Bread and Water, Dylan's Hard Rain, we can do that. Uh, let's see. Love girl, give me some love girl for all you lovers out there. See.
Well, I hope you guys are enjoying this. It's kind of weird. I can't see anybody or hear nobody, but, you know, I can see y'all. Posting your comments up here, I really appreciate it. Thank you all for tuning in. I hope you're enjoying it. And uh, yeah, I hope there's something we can do more often. Sure. Cheers, you guys. What else? I got a few notes from my, my wife. She told me I better talk about here. Uh, we made some cantina posters for today's show. You can go to ryanbinglingstore.com and I'll sign it uh, before we send it to you. And uh, oh, I got a little virtual tip jar up here too if you want to help me buy my baby some new shoes uh, for next year if you don't ain't, ain't no big deal either um, just glad you're hanging out here with me wanting to hear some songs thanks for letting me play for y'all 
uh, let's see, let's do another one. Let's do, uh, somebody asked me for a Baracho station. Bruce Davis Wolves, I can do that. Pontiac, Brandon McCarty, all right. Tristan Martinez, there you are, buddy. Let's play, uh, this is one of the first, the first song I ever learned on the guitar. It's called, it's called a Malagueño. I gotta turn some of this stuff off, it's too distracting. <laughs> Pouring y'all a drink over there too, all right. <laughs> I got a little fan club in here. They better be careful, I'll turn the camera on. Anyway, this is the first song I ever learned. Um, I was living down in Laredo, Texas, and uh, this fella taught me this first little part. He said, that was all he kind of showed me until I learned that. And then he come back and he showed me this part. And he come back another week and he showed me this part. And then I ended up writing this little song called Baracho Station. Uh, I was hanging out, out in Van Horn, Texas. And uh, there's an exit off the highway called Baracho Station Exit. And uh, that's where this ranch was, where was hanging out. And uh, I was sitting there outside this little bunkhouse and these fellas were building a, a rock sidewalk and I was sitting there with my guitar drinking beer and I started writing this song just looking off you could see the mountains of Mexico where I was sitting out across this ranch and it was just a beautiful place and uh, I was wanting to write some lyrics in Spanish and uh, I knew a few kind of words you know I, knew, I could speak a little bit of broken Spanish you know from living down on the border but uh, not really enough to carry a conversation with somebody, so um, as I was writing, uh, these fellas helped me translate the words into uh, in Spanish. I wrote Bracho Station, and a lot of times I play these two songs together. <laughs>
la sierra y toca la sierra trabajando amigos asintiendo de pie aquí nos montamos caballos borrachos esperando a siente el sol Jordan from Seattle. Hello, lady. Tune this up to uh, open E. Tina Security right here. He's a mean dude. Thank you, Boudreaux. I think people would probably rather see you than they would see you. Little <laughs> boo Ola from me. Graydon? Graydon Arthur? From you and Rocky? Ola said your name right there, Funda. Guess who's knocking off and do that? See you later, Tristan. You gotta go finish that horse out. I understand. All right. Don't forget to buckaroo on me a peanut. <laughs>
made my way up to the big time. I checked myself into the lost and found. And what do you know? My baby come for me. Now I'm living a good life. Away from all of the bad advice. I take every day like it's paradise. So people don't fuck with me. I'm carrying my trouble This pack strapped to my shoulder Ever since I was a baby I've been running from everything I know Don't you tell me about my trouble Cause you know nothing about my trouble Nobody knows about my trouble Except for my baby and me Alright as we get in here and play some harmonica, I got these from Mickey Raphael. Back when we was lucky enough, we got to do a few tours with uh, Willie Nelson back in the day. He gave me these things. Uh, pretty cool. Thank you, Mickey. Hope you're doing good out there. Gene Schultz. Gene, 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 ever wonder why? I'll try to do that. From a desto. On the south 
side of the head Take me home I've been gone so long it's getting I get this guess who's knocking song. I haven't played it much on an acoustic guitar. It's all the same. I uh, um, first wrote this song, um, I wrote it about an orphan that got left behind and uh, you know later on through the years come back to kick the world in the teeth you know and um, the reason I just the, the chorus was uh, it's me, mother, I'm knocking on the door, you know, and uh, we was in the studio recording it, and I was just sitting there, just kind of joking, messing around, and I said, you know, it's me, motherfucker, knocking on the door, and uh, my buddy, just Stanley, that was producing the record, he's like, man, that's staying on the record, and so it ended up kind of getting stuck on there, um, but I know for some people it might offend you, but uh, we was just kind of playing around with that, the, the real song was kind of heavy, I guess. So, in case there's any kids out there. I don't know. 
That's that. Let's move on. I'll practice a little bit for the next time. What else? Somebody wanted to hear Snake Eyes, huh? Sunrise, Snake Eyes. Cool. Sounds good out there. All right. I can remember every word to every song I've ever written, and this some days I can't hardly remember my own name. Falling down on me before you chase the rain. This is so, we can do that. Let's play a fun one. That's a fun one to play. Play this guitar. Close enough for the campfire. 
with me. Blue girl, you hold it down on everybody. Don't let those goats in the door. Carrie Chavez Thompson, this mama's happy, all right. Oh, you can go see the Lulu Queen. New Broncos, Texas, Candace. John Cole. Who is that on my t-shirt? This is my good friend, Mr. Terry Allen. And it says, today's rainbow is tomorrow's tamale. And, uh... Terry is a brilliant artist, musician, songwriter, sculptor. Um, if you're not familiar with his stuff, go check him out. He's uh, been a huge inspiration to me over the years. Probably the probably biggest influence um, on me. Just the way kind of he looks at the world, the way he interprets things, and um, I don't know. He's just a he's just a cool cat and uh, nice guy. <laughs> Play a song by Terry here. They've got a Terry Allen song.
down, wanna put me out of my way. And I remember the cop with the slick black hair when he told me to get out of there. And I remember the judge with his gold blade of mouth, he said you live in the north, you're gonna die down south, you're gonna die down south, son. So I'm going back to my home in the Stephenville, Texas. It's called the Water Hole. It had a little pool table in the corner and a bar, and then fellas would let me sit in there, you know, on Wednesday nights and play the two or three songs that I knew. Um, and I remember I had this little tip jar that uh, it was a tip box. It was made out of an old cigar box that stayed pretty empty. <laughs> so yeah, this one's uh, kind of about that. I'd sit there in the corner and pull my hat down over my eyes and uh, try to just make it through the night.
Stevie Ray Vaughan over there. This is Chris Christopherson up here. It's a picture of me and my wife dancing after our wedding. Uh, this is a cool little poem that my friend Nicole gave me. It says, uh, I can sail the waters of all the world, bitter and wild and blue, and never find a friend to love. Like the friend I found in you, I can walk down all the roads of the world and knock on the doors forever. Never I'd find a friend like you. Never, never, never. Uh, J.P. McAvoy. What else I got up here? Got some whiskey. Got some Casamigas tequila. My buddy Randy Gerber. Got uh, some old boots. These were my dad's boots. When he was a little boy. They're bronze. I've been keeping them right there. I got my leather kit. I got my leather tools. I do a little... Kind of leather work just for fun. Nothing, anything that would impress anybody, but uh, you know, just kind of ranchy stuff. Got old Trucker Jesus up here that I got down in Georgia. Um, yeah, I don't know. If you guys want to know what something is, let me know. I'll, I'll tell you. Got me a little refrigerator with some cold beers. I got some. Let's drink some whiskey. This is a picture of me and Joe Ely, way back in the day. Joe Ely is a big influence on me too. Um, there was some times I was having some hard times, and I, he and his wife Sharon were kind enough to let me live at their house for a while, and uh, they kind of took me in and let me heal up a bit, if you know what I mean. Here's Joe and all you folks. I got my dog Boo in here. I got my wife Anna and her cousin Benelin is over here. They're hiding from the camera. I'll sneak them in here someday. Let's see, what else? Quarantine situation. We're all in this together. I bet y'all are tired of hearing that shit. But uh, yeah, I'm here with you. I hope you guys are enjoying these songs and, um, you know, I hope it does something for you. It uh, definitely helps me a bit get some of this stuff out. Um, yeah. What 
it's worth A nickel's just a nickel, son Your pleasure is your pain, it's gonna hurt When you're out on the road Like an old horse walking along Shaking all the miles been rode Hard and mean Through the valley of the shadows Wickedness unravels It's a crooked man Dealing cards to an honest man Stealing up all his farming land There ain't no rain All the crops are burned dry Except for the tear in his mama's eye In her eyes Everything is fine With one touch Wild to turn to rust Well tell me Who is there to trust Anymore We're falling fast We're like a rock Hitting glass Running from Some shattered past Tell me all I need Is a guitar string And a bended knee Country boys all I need to be All right, made it through that. Let's see here. Play something fun. I got time for a couple more here, huh? What time is it? We've been rolling along here a bit. Rosie from Georgetown. Hi, Rosie. Let's see here. Another Aussie, Lisa Har Harvey from Australia. What time is it over there? Man. Thank you, guys. Colleen, your wife is gorgeous. Thank you, Colleen. She is gorgeous. Renee, your cousin Vinland was so kind to me during your last Houston show. She is probably one of the nicest people in the world. I get to talk about them when they're sitting in the room. Mm -hmm. Let's see, let me get another guitar here. Let's play... Um, we gotta play another fun one here, huh? Do bread and water? Yeah. Let me get tune that up. Let me see. This is my my Waterloo guitar right here. It's one of my favorite guitars ever. I take these on the road with me. Um, good folks at Collins Guitars in Austin, Texas, make these. And my buddy Charlie Sexton first turned this on, turned me on to these guitars. He had one, and he said, "Man, I think you would dig this." And um, I sure do. And uh, the good folks at Collins they they got some of these Dearman pickups. These are old vintage Dearman pickups from the '60s, and um, put these in there. And we uh, wired it like a jazz bass. So I got a uh, I got a, a pickup in here. What do I got in here? Like a K and K or something like that. And then I got this. And these are two separate volume knobs. I can blend these separate. My buddy uh, uh, Brad Clifford wired that up for me like that. So I can run the P or the the arm through an amplifier and pedals and all that stuff. And then I got a clean signal right here going just to a DI. And I kind of blend the two. And you know you can mess around and do all kinds of weird shit. 
Most of the time it's more than I can handle, but uh, you know, I get through it all right uh, sometimes. Hmm. Oh, I know what we're going to play first. Hold on. I got the mandolin out for a reason, and I just saw somebody tuned in from Ireland. <laughs> Play y'all one of my favorite Steve Earle songs. Yeah, all right. <laughs> I remember it, Steve. Uh, Steve's another big influence on me, man. You know, I'm being a Texas kid out there, you know, playing in Texas growing up, you know, guys like Steve and Joe Ely and Terry Allen and Guy Clark and Towns Van Zandt. You know, those are, those are, you know, those were my people. That's where I was. They were where they were from where I was from, you know, I thought. So anyway. I always thought this song was just some old ass Irish song, you know, that that Steve covered and then I found out that he wrote it and and then I got to go to Ireland and, and met some people that, that know Steve and they're like, Yeah, didn't you know she they he said they said uh, Steve's like more Irish than the Irish. <laughs> <laughs> Best songwriter, songwriter's bark time for sure. I'll uh, shut up and sing. Well, I took a stroll down the old long walk of the IAIA. I met a little girl and we stopped to talk on a fine soft D.I. summertime and if I like to work outside in the backyard a lot do some gardening and some ranching and some farming and uh, you know just play around with that stuff and it just keeps the sun off my neck uh, you know I'll take it seriously but not that seriously I've had enough sad days in my life I'm, I'm looking forward to living good days from here on out
lost touch, dropped it and broke her heart. I drove off a cliff and I barely missed walking with her in the park. Just a selfish boy. But I have not forgotten that the food in the pot ain't cooking for a boy like me. Fighting all night, the dogs in the alley looking for a bone to eat. Starving to death. Never mind trouble with the hustle and the bustle. Payment on your house is late. If I ever had a problem like that, I guess I'd be in pretty good shape. Kiss my ass goodbye. When I feel the wind blow, I see the ghost in the road and headlights are beautiful sights. And out in the desert, I can sit on up in heaven and the sun keeps setting for miles. And here comes another song. Then I take a pill, a little piece of pepper, and I scream along down the line. What you hear now is something I have found that's been hiding way down inside. On the cellar of my heart. I hope everybody had a real good time. I hope I didn't bring you down. Oh, these ain't sad songs. Don't take them wrong. I just haven't been home in a while. Thank you for sticking around. Thank you all very much. I hope y'all have enjoyed this uh, Cantina Jam. And, uh, see you on the next one.